let's make a procedure. Let's create some tables. First, we're going to create our first table. Next, next, we're going to enter data into our table. And finally, we're going to view the data in the table. To start creating our tables, we need to navigate to the ABAP dictionary. So we go to transaction SE11. Inside the ABAP dictionary, we select database table and we type the name of our table. Remember to always start with the letter Z. Then I like using the letter T because to tell the system or to remind myself, I'm sorry, that this is going to be a table. So I use T and then underscore and then a table description. Let's create a table to store the information of the passengers for a flight. So let's call it passengers. ZT passengers. And then we click on create. The system gives us a warning that the underscore is not permitted at the second or the third position. So let's modify this. So let's put Z T A that means table underscore passenger. Now we click on create and now the system permits us to create our table. So this is going to be table for passengers. Now we need to complete all the mandatory fields on the screen. We can identify the mandatory fields because they have that little uh, checkbox with that it is checked all the time. So we complete this obligatory field, the delivery class. We have a lot of options here. We're going to choose an application table. 